What are you doing on this ship anyway? If anything happens to my pals on Callisto, you'll pay. I didn't kill them. I don't believe you. Your skills are getting worse, Dingo. You've been slacking off. Noman. Ken, back off. Let me introduce you to Dingo. He was the leading pilot in our unit six years ago. Dingo Egret? Military records show him dead. You're doing rather menial work compared to the old days. Have you been demoted to the outskirts? Shut up. You have come back under my command. Come back? You must be kidding! You'd better come back. It'll be fun from now on. I refuse! Your fooling around almost killed me back there. It's not funny! You don't understand. You can't deceive me with beautiful words like freedom and independence anymore! Do you realize how many of my comrades died back there? Say it! You killed them! I wouldn't know. You devil! Dingo! Come back. I like you. You make me sick. You dispose of the body. I've never heard anything like this before. Are you sure this order is from Colonel Noman? If not, why would I be doing such a thing? Ready? Please begin.
Awake? You've been asleep for two months. <sighs> I shaved your beard. Ada, please look after him. If I have to. Where am I? You're on Demos Station, the gateway to Mars. How are you feeling? I feel really sick. It's better than feeling dead, isn't it? I didn't die, did I? You didn't, but you did lose your heart and lungs. So how can I still be alive? You can only stay alive when you're aboard Jehuti. Jehuti? The machine supplements your heart and lungs. That power comes from Jehuti. What? The minute you get off Jehuti, it will stop providing energy. You will die if you leave Jehuti. Oh, don't talk nonsense. Well, try it if you like. Insane! How could you do this to me? I had no choice. The cockpit is too small to put in all the gear needed to keep you alive. I didn't want this! I told you if you helped me, I would save your life. I don't remember. When did you say that? Just before, when you nearly died. I don't remember! You should be more appreciative of me. I saved your life, looked after you, and kept you hidden from the other crew for two months. Damn. Hook me up to proper vitals. I can give your real body back, so you'd better just accept my orders. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. How can I follow Baram? I'm not Baram. What? Quite the opposite. I'm with the Space Force. I'm Ken Marineris. I've been sent into hiding in Baram. <laughs> Are you serious? Don't be so surprised all the time. Why not? I said we don't have much time, didn't I? I didn't want to do this either. First, you have to escape from Deimos as soon as possible. You're in danger if we stay here wasting time talking. It's hard for a dead man to understand. You are still alive. So what? No man is still alive, too. Don't you want vengeance on him? He killed my comrades. I have the same aim as you, so I won't do anything bad to you. Can I just ask you one question? What? Is it correct this year's winner was Hesperia Gales? What? Can't you be more serious? I'm very serious. Do you know the answer? <sighs> We've no time for games on Mars. The catapult to eject ships is over there. You can get out if you go along this way. Satellite Deimos is under Balram now. Unmanned machines are on patrol to attack support units of the Space Force from Earth. Deimos is under Balram's rule? Not just Deimos. Mars and another satellite, Phobos. All of Mars' area has been under Balram's control. Noman has performed great deeds. That's awful. Unexpected things have occurred. Anyway, please consult Ada about the catapult. I received a rescue signal. Ignore it. Connected. This is Taper. I'm stuck with a cargo of freight. Please help me. Which line is this, Ada? This is from the Space Force. Listen to his story, Dingo. 